quite a quite an interesting specimen from pre-1982 to my Namibia. Uh, first of all, high content Galena matrix. Uh, relative weight of the specimen is pretty heavy. Uh, we have this crystallization on the top going across the top. I think I have it on one of my still pictures. Quite red, so that could be iron oxide staining the, what I believe, now I haven't looked under magnification yet, but I think we're looking at the uh, rhombohedral form of the uh, smithsonite, maybe associated with some of the more almost cubic looking smithsonite sitting across there. But these little blades over here, I think are the rhombo rhombodendrons of, of uh, smithsonite crystallization sitting on top of that would be well it could be some serocyte i'm a little bit unsure my my knowledge of tumeb is pretty basic um so so getting into the the, the finer rarities you'll see on my on my item description if i find something which i i haven't mentioned in the video, I definitely mention it there. And of course the specialists would see. My, my main aim is here to give you an accurate uh, indication of the actual specimen. Uh, still pictures don't make it look all that exciting. It is rather grey. Yet there's a hell of a lot happening here. And Sumeb, uh, as is, is uh, 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 this piece is aesthetically appealing. And under magnification, there are no words. I, I'd actually not be able to do a video. I wouldn't have a thing to say um, uh, when you look at these sections under magnification. All the way from Namibia, of course, the famous old Sumeb mine. Uh, what I think we're looking at here is Smithsonite on Smithsonite, but it could be a little bit of Serucite associated. Now, from this section, um, there was quite a lot of Serucite, quite a lot of Malachite, quite a lot of Azurite. Um, so, uh, uh, perhaps some Serucite uh, associated with the Smithsonite. And then, of course, this interesting uh, uh, redness across here, which would most likely be the iron oxides. Let me just take you, and this would be the top of the specimen. So, it could be displayed all the way around, even looking from the top down, pretty perfect. From Namibia, famous old Sumeb mine.